I see London. I see France. I see my sword going through your pants. Will you come back here, you bitch? Ha! You damn fool. Scared the shit out of your horse. And that's why you don't mess with a witch, you bitch. Follow the red-footed road. Follow the red-footed road. Follow the, follow the, follow the, follow the, follow the red-footed road. Where the fuck did it go? Signs of burns. Noon Wraith did this. Not another one of these goddamn things. Whatever he saw just before he died gave him quite a scare. Are you trying to be funny, Geralt? The thing he saw moments before death gave him a scare? Nah, I'm, I'm sure he was just greeted with a smile and a wave and a kiss and he was happy that he was about to be murdered by whatever the fuck mutilated the poor little guy. You should know, by the way, that this thing is like four levels higher than me, and yet I'm actually dealing damage to it, and it's still dealing damage to me. You see, this is why you don't use level 1 equipment when you're fighting something that's level goddamn 10. But you know what I was doing last time you saw me fight one of these things? I am an idiot. It's okay to laugh at me. Ow! Oh. <gasps> don't get careless. Don't get careless. I'm in no mood to be doing all this a goddamn again, thank you very fucking much. What on earth was that? You just fought out of your front! That's fucking bringing Queef to a whole new level. Uh... We'll just ignore the part where her dress just stayed there. Suck my dick, you bloody spectral bugger. God damn, that was a pain in the ass and then some. For once, that wasn't a waste of time. If you're saying something, because the last goddamn noon wraith I killed was more of a waste of time than wiping your ass before you're about to dive headfirst into a cesspit. Ooh! It's got a whole bunch of free stuff, and now I'm overburdened. I think I'm about to be able to sneak away from this wyvern. No, I'm not. Oh, why does it always rain on me? Okay, Mr. Wyvern, bring it. Go on, bite at me. There you go, I got my bloody health back thanks to that. Although you did just break my shield. Jesus Christ, that went completely down. Sweet, suffering succotasso is not good for me, and that damage is so minuscule, I might as well be prodding at you with toothpicks. Will you please stop dragging out this fight? Fight me! Oh, mighty fighter, come on! Come on, I want my health back, damn it. Whoever recommended that I get this Quen sign, the upgraded version. Wow, why the hell do I throw everything away the moment I got damn piled up together? Seriously, it's like saving up 10,000 fucking pounds and then immediately spending on something you don't fucking need. Come on, do it. Good boy. Now, down doggy. Can I kill this thing? Can, is this going to be like a 20 minute fight? God damn it. It won't be if you goddamn die, will it? It'll be a two minute bloody death sentence that you were willing to put yourself into. Where are you? He's just running away from her. He just ran off. He's flying off. He landed to run away on the ground to- What is this thing? Why are you such a coward? You're like ten times the size of me. Ah, that's what I get for getting greedy. It's for a reason it's one of the seven deadly sins, because it'll fucking get you killed. You see, this feels like a true battle. This is- This feels like the kind of challenge that the game was meant to be putting forward. Not noon rates that fall fucking down more than a flower petal in a hurricane. I got it down like a third health and that's it. And it's been a good, like, six minutes finding this. Not a joke. This, I, this feels like I'm playing Monster Hunter more than I'm playing a goddamn RPG Witcher game. I mean, Monster Hunter is kind of an RPG, but you know what I'm saying. Got greedy! Bloody hell, that was close. Oh god, that was like a toenail away from just scratching my entire face off. Come on. There we go. Speaking of face off, if I wasn't such a cruel beast and I captured you, I'd put you inside a Nicolas Cage. Will you just die? What the hell? This requires more effort than fucking sitting through a bloody A-level exam. Don't you screech at me, you little shit. You're not one of Daenerys Targaryen's precious little fucking poo babbies. You're gonna get screwed. Just to bear in mind, if I were the same level as this thing, the only thing that would have happened is that I would have killed it much quicker and the fight would have been a lot less interesting because it likely would have done a lot less damage to me as well. You know what I was about to say? With your name and the small threat and danger you've been putting me under for the last god knows how long, I may just have to refer to you as Wyvern Troyer. Come on, bite me. Thank you. The awkward moment where you attacking me actually benefits me. God bless, Quen. I'd rather if you didn't Ramsey Bolton the shit out of my genitalia. Thank you very much. I am a fool. All I've got to do is be an absolute master bitch, hide inside my bubble shield and chow down on Rob Stark's liver, and I'll be fine. Seriously, when it comes to a battle like this, with a giant beast such as this, you really cannot be an improviser. You're not gonna get away with winging it. That kind of attitude and preparation ain't gonna fly with a battle such as this. I'd just like to point out, by the way, there was literally no need for me to kill this thing. The treasure it was guarding, Oh, I feel bad now. The treasure it was guarding I already took before it even fought me. I didn't have to kill this, but I chose to anyway. I really do feel bad. Is this just a fucking noon race just wandering about? What? 
fuck it, I'll take the challenge. Bring it, bitch. What is it with noon wraiths just being a more common occurrence than a fucking happy marriage? I don't get it. I mean, maybe they weren't married, but happy relationship. You could say that every single relationship in this place made just like the Titanic, and it hit rocky waters, and they all ended up sinking. I literally just did away with a noon wraith as if it were an annoying fly in my house. What the? Okay, how is that thing alive? That literally looks like the son of the Green Goblin. He found out about his father's death and he was gutted. Where is this sonning thing? Oh, now I know why you're called a fucking foglet. Get out of it, you... Oh, well, that's a reasonable... Oh! I was about to say that's a reasonable amount of damage. Then you hit me. You ain't going anywhere, fella. You were gonna... What the... Those were illusions. You are... All right, then. I just got bitch slapped to death. You really are Harry Osborne. But you're significantly fucking stronger. What have you been doing? Gobbling some bloody steroids. Okay. Let's try again. And this time, let's try and igni the actual source and not the bloody source pun. That made no sense. Oh, God. Just going to flail wildly. Come on with that. What the f- Are you- s All right, then. I guess I was asking for that one by, um, not having five times more health? <gasps> Jesus! Don't pull your punches whatever you goddamn do. His physical presentation is not an accurate representation of his actual emotional standing. This thing is far from gutless. He's got balls bigger than space hoppers he's coming at me with that much ferocity. Okay, I've consorted the bestiary. I now know its weaknesses. Apparently one of the weaknesses is Quen. I hope they're not kidding. Hello, Foglets. Which disappeared immediately. Go on, show yourself. Hey, there you go. That didn't quite work as in... Intended. Just one hit. Just one. So do those foglets just disappear naturally? Yeah, they sure do. Oh, that's them in the distance, whispering about like Casper the Friendly. Ghost. It sure is. How about that? What? Do you time these things with the utmost precision? Because it is unfair. Oh my! I'm about to quit. I'm about to quit. I'm about to throw the goddamn controller through the fucking wall and give the neighbors a present. I swear to God, if these loading times get any longer, I'm gonna think I'm trying to load this fucking thing on a Commodore 64. You know what I'm saying? Because I'm not kidding when I say that these loading screens are like one to two minutes long every goddamn time for simply rewinding the clock to where I was stood not ten seconds ago. Are you fucking serious? Okay. Oh no. No, there you go. He hit me when I had fucking. Da da da. The Quen on. No, you don't, you cheeky little shit. Get out of my life. More specifically, your own. I really. I completely forgot about Quen's original use and not the goddamn bubble shield. I'm a bloody. I'm a stickler for using the upgraded versions and nothing other than that. It's so inconsistent. Sometimes he stops after the first hit, other times he doesn't. I thought the Quen thing stunned him. I was completely wrong. Where are these foglets? There you go. No! What the. I didn't know it was him! Oh. I like the gimmick of this boss. I like it, but it's pissing me off, for fuck's sake. He spawned two foglets, I killed one, and thought the other one was just the harmless little thing that might as well be attacking me with a feather duster. What? He spawned them immediately? Cheeky bugger. Where is he? I'll just- oh, there you go. I'll attack wildly until I fucking hit you, and then lose bloody health because of it. Will you stop being a coward spawning these little bloody J&J security looking motherfuckers? Come at me, bro. Hey, there you go. Found you at long last, and he just wasted my quen shield. I hate your little foglet, seriously. There you go, little foglet. Suck my knob. With the- And he spawned two more of them. Are you kidding me? Almost got greedy, and almost screwed it all up. Almost balled it up into a nice goddamn bundle, and lobbed it into the abyss, he says, as he lobs it into the abyss, seriously. Artorius would be proud. I'll just keep whiffing and waving until eventually I hit you. I will. I don't care. I don't care about the consequences of looking like a damn fool, attacking at shadows on the wall. How did you evade that? Down with you! Down into the dirt from whence you came, you filthy little philanthropist looking motherfucker. <sighs> I got another weapon and I got a foglet trophy. What's happening now? What? My quen shield popped because of a cutscene. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I get to watch the same thing from before when I didn't do this when I took the Noon Wraith trophy. Okay, makes sense to me. Considering how busy this goddamn little old witcher is, and how many things he has on his to-do list, the fact he just ticked one off right there equals him being just a little bit less swamped. And on that note, ladies and gentlemen, I think I'll be ending the episode. Seeing as this is a quote unquote return to a series, and a fair amount of you wanted this back, please do remember to voice your opinion and like the video if you want to see more of it in the future, and then I'll do it a little bit more regularly than usual, because it seems like people wanted a little bit less of it, so I did less, and then people wanted more. I can't win. <laughs> but that's, that's the nature of it, I'm fine, but I don't actually mind. Just let me know if you want to see this, like, every 
two, three days, maybe? There you go. That's that's the basis. But anyway, seeing as my content has come to a close, I recommend that you check out some of the others listed here. You can go check out some of the best edited content on the site from Tomato Gaming. You can check out some of the best reaction stuff from Chadtronic, which is... <laughs> There's more to his stuff than just reactions. He also edits his stuff, and it's hilarious. I literally spent, like, all night watching his back catalogue of content. It's fantastic. And if you like the more insane and wacky stuff, then go and watch What the Fuck, Bra. His content's bloody brilliant as well. And if you prefer more complete playthroughs of things from small channels with a lot of goddamn potential and charm, then I'd recommend watching Finpire Hearts Bros or Seth Orvan. They're all fantastically good at what they do, and they're all covering a good variety of games between the three of them. And uh, one final thing, I humbly request you follow me on Twitch, Twitter, and my other channel, because something or all of those for all of you. So, that aside, I'd like to think that you did indeed enjoy this, and do you want to see more of it, and assuming that you do, please do like the video to let you know, and assuming that you did, then I think it... Then I think it's safe to say, then considering the small break that I took from this game, and everybody assuming I was done with it, assuming you did enjoy this and want to see more of it, it's a damn good thing that I did not turn this into the ditcher. I don't really know why people thought I abandoned it, but people, people weren't enjoying it that much at the time, so I figured I'd give it a break, and then all of a sudden everybody's crying that they want it back. I'm a people pleaser. You get what you ask for, so ask for what you want.